Josh Scoo said he like racing me today, so we're on. We're racing, bro. He's been calling me out since the camps, bro. So today's the day, bro. I'm gonna show him the Holy Kai run. Yeah, I got him, bro. Local knowledge, bro. But he is. Fucking <laughs> Josh, like sanded his wing last night. It's getting all serious, huh? Josh Crew invitation. What's the rules? Josh Crew drinks a beer for everybody that beats him. Is it, is it hot? Is it today? Josh Crew invitational. <laughs> you gotta drink a beer for everybody that beats you. <laughs> Timian's putting the pipe and made his wing on the line. Double or nothing. <laughs> I'm here at China Walls with my friends Simeon and Josh. I'm about to fucking smoke them. Probably. We're going downwind. Josh is trying to race me. But this is only his third time doing the Hawaii Kai run. I'm a freaking local on this run. 700. It's what the real champions ride but I don't ride it, it's my first time. All right, this is the fucking famed race. We got myself up against Jackie Boy and oh, Simeon. <laughs> fucking, they want to take out the Aussie, but I don't know. Boys might have chose the wrong foil. But today we're doing the Hawaii Kai run to um, Kai Mana. Uh, 15K run, jumping off the rocks here. Got Malay coming as well. Oh, and we got this scared cat, Mr. Voyager himself. I don't want to do the. He's been gene it up. Oh, Come on, James man. K James Casey, this one's for you. <laughs> Come on, there's a set coming. That's my strategy, bro. Oh. oh shit. Shit. Find a way, find a way. You gotta find a way, find a way today. All right, I'm up. First bump took me a while to stand up. Tail feels all right. Just kind of safety foil, safety surf it. All right, we're off. That was a fucking horrible pop up, but got it. Boys are all cutting left. Ooh, Josh is having a shotgun.
little celebrity right here. You got Nick. Josh has a trophy. I am making some bad mistakes. Boys have cut wide out and I've taken this shitty inside line. Let's see if I can still catch it. Guys, this is actually so ass right now. Alright, I'm gaining on Malahi and Jack. Inside line might be paying off. Shit, no, bro. So many cut cost. Uh, 770 for the 120 cut. So we had a little bit of a Mario Kart start. Low tide makes it a little bit trickier to pop up. But we got Murray got up. Maybe Josh had a little bit of a fell on one, but he's up after that for sure. Runs pretty good. Small, but like maybe a seven. Riding the 800 Eagle X. New tailwind feels all right, fine. Nico, feels good, bro. Feels good. That's the guy that made the tail. Little local wizard. Boys are working. Didn't know you. What out of 10 you call this for a Hawaii Kai, but oh, we're working. Catching up on John Hearn, one of the local legends here. He organizes all these local Oahu races for all the crew in the Hawaiian Islands out of the love of his heart. Holy shit. It's so hard right now. Joshy boys, 100 yards and closing, mate. Sometimes it's up on the gas pedal. Keep coming. That's right. No panic.
Just a couple more special up and overs. Open up that gap again. Super flat section here in the middle. Not much going on. Hard to go fast. Average speed up. So let the foil work, let the foil run. I hope Josh is frozen, baby. No panic. Wish I could talk more, but just pumping so much just to try and catch this. Motherfucker up the front, Simeon. He's riding the 800 Eagle X. So, he's got 30 square centimeters on me. Just probably helping through this quiet section in the middle here. Let's see if the 770 code can work through that low range. Oh, we're starting up some soil popping up again. Staying super high on my arm. Uh, Trying to capitalize on all these ground cells coming through. I think that's the thing when we're racing and Trying to go as fast as you can. If you think about it too much, you get all in your head. Decision making is a little bit funny. Not as smooth, not as flowy, not as efficient. So don't worry about where other people are or what they're doing. Focus on yourself and what you can do. There we go. For sure, gaining on Simeon now. He's starting to cut right. He stopped his outside line up and over this swell. Just trying to keep the distance in between these troughs to really make sure I got a downhill and glide as long as I want. Really just to recover as it's a hard run. I think he's ahead of Jack and Malai, so. Josh, your boy's moving good. Take the camera, boy. On the Is he still recording? Yeah. Alright, I'm gaining on this motherfucker. 
Here we go. Always looking left to see if something else is forming out here. I'm coming for ya! I'm with local celebrity, Jack from town, and I don't know, if you haven't heard of him, I feel kind of bad, he forgot his crutches, so it's like, He's just so crippled with just carrying the burden of having to like talk to all his fans, you know, like it's just like really hard life, you know, terrible. All right, in a race scenario, Simeon, I think was the first to get up. That means everything mentally because he knows he's in front. My job right here is to trail him see if my ocean reading skills and foil choice is better than his. That's why we love racing. Oh, I'm getting so close to him now and he doesn't even know it. This motherfucker too. Paddles up with a sup, but still continues to carry a fucking selfie pole. What the fuck is that? Oh, that was a bad mistake. Just went up the hill, lost all my glide. Now trying to find another big skull to get down. Am I fast enough to get down this? Nope. I'm gonna come back again, do a turn, wash my speed, try line up in this next swell. Just losing one swell line position. Mistake you don't wanna make at all in racing. Went down a fast bump. All right, so Mr. Voyager himself, Simeon, he is the man who started this whole movement. And utmost respect for him. You know, he's not doing this Voyager thing for money, but for a club, for community, for a place where all people can connect froth out and I think that's so fucking cool. So cool. Just need to put this motherfucker in his place. But yeah I'm here this week helping Simon and Kahi with their downwind Voyager camp. And all these amazing people from around the world who want to experience this epicness of downwinding miles out to sea, riding that endless wave. Oh, I really need to find some energy. I'm getting tired. There we go, see, I'm gonna continue this wide line. Hopefully the current out here Makes these swell and bumps stand up. Inside line, I found the last few days. It's more direct, but the bumps and energy are quite small. All right, I'm gapping Malahe and, and Jack. So I'm stoked about that. Two young guns from over here. Old dogs have still got it. Here we go. Come on, glide, baby. YouTube content, you tell. Oh, yeah. Wow. This is my idol right here. Unfortunately, he's just been so crippled by the burden of like having to talk to everyone lately. It's so sad. What a terrible life.
Wow. Simon is definitely cutting right. I don't know if that's a tactic that I should follow, but I'm continuing to cut left on these swells and bumps, hoping that the right choice. Maybe a six, so it was wind, there was texture. It was just technical, technical in the sense that you couldn't go up and over. So, some of the local knowledge comes in. You got Josh boy coming in right now. Let me get to the beach. He's up on foil, but maybe 100 yards behind. I'm about 20 yards from shore. Let's see. Tricky coming in, you got those offshore things. Oh, I'm hitting. Got this motherfucker! an epic finish we had Simeon who absolutely smoked me but he came down in the in the channel here at Kaimana and taking his time paddling on his chest and I fucking came up behind him and nearly overtook him but he beat me to the lifeguard tower because he said that's where you got to touch to win so yeah <laughs> nah that was fucking sick bro sick man so sick <laughs> Woo! Yeah, the winner. There he is, number three. <laughs> that run fucking sucks. <laughs> what, what was that out of ten for you guys? Three. Yeah, I thought so. I just fell the whole way. Oh. All right, that was epic. Can't wait to show you guys. We'll see you on the next one, which was fucking horrible. Two for the uncle, zero for the drums. <laughs>